Hello, Cancer. So let's do your reading um, for October. So today is October 1st, I believe. Yeah, it's October 1st. Let's see what the universe wants to reveal to you for this month. Mm -hmm. About anything. So your last two readings were very good. Let's see. Let's see if this will be a continuation or if they want to show you something new. So universe, please step in and show Cancerians energies that they will be working with for the month of October 2019. Energies for Cancerians. Cancer. Mm -hmm. Five of Wands. Seven of Cups. Three of Swords. A lot of drama going on here. A lot of drama, a lot of choices. So you're dealing with uh, a lot of miscommunication, disagreements with various people. This is on the home front and at work. Three of Swords showed up. Let's clarify the Three of Swords for Cancerians, please. Knight of Swords, Strength card. So you are battling with somebody that has caused you a lot of heartache. And they can be quite vicious with their mouth. But it shows you're going to be more than okay. So if this ha has anything to do with lawsuits or money, you will win. So it shows good energy again, even though it shows a lot of challenges you're going through. Dealing with a lot of aggravation. Mm-hmm. Yes. Let's see. More messages for Cancerians. Universe, please step in. Show us more messages for the sign of Cancer for October. So... Cancerians, a lot of you are dealing with a person that is showing up here as the king of swords. So that would represent a Libra, Gemini, and Aquarius. Something to do with money, finances, three of pentacles again. Six of Wands. So, victory again coming to you. So, even though you're going to go through a lot of aggravation, not just October, but even uh, towards the end of the year, you will be victorious. Again, victory card. Six of Wands. I want to clarify this Page of Swords. Universe, please clarify this Page of Swords. So this person is trying to hide resources from you because here they're showing us page of swords with the hangman and they're showing now they're showing up as king of pentacles. Yeah, look at this three of swords again for you. So you've been going through a lot of heartache because of this person. But you're going to be fine. Victory card showed up again. Six of Wands. Now, I want to clarify the energies on this King of Swords towards you. For a lot of you, it will be a Gemini. Because that's the sign that's in front of you. So you know this individual from other lifetimes. Universe, please clarify this uh, King of Swords energy towards Cancerians. Justice. So a lot of you are dealing with court system. Could be anything. Could be divorce. Could be some kind of monetary settlements. Anything. This is good. Good, good, good. They, they're going to have to pay the money. Oh yeah, they're going to have to pay up. Yeah. But you're going to have to deal with this person for a while. You're going to have to deal with this person. But um, you, you, once you're civil with them, it's going to 
get better. Mm -hmm. Now let's see their attitude towards you and their intentions towards you and feelings. Universe, please step in and show us this uh, King of Swords attitude, feelings, and intentions towards Cancerians. So, Gemini, a lot of you are dealing with the Gemini energy right here, the lover's card. This also means this individual is your soulmate from other lifetimes. So, you had unfinished soul business and you had to meet them and deal with them in this lifetime as well. They're hiding a lot of secrets from you, including money. With the moon card, this also means they are confused on how to deal with this uh, world card so you you're gonna be okay look at this you showed up as queen of pentacles so they know already that you're gonna be okay i want to clarify this moon card from them towards you universe please clarify the moon card Yeah, they're going to try to fight you every way they can. Seven of Wands. Nine of Cups. Ten of Cups. You're going to be very good and happy with the end result. Mm -hmm. And they know it. So, if the courts are involved, so that's good for you. Uh, let's see. Universe, please step in and show binding energies important binding energies between cancerians and the other person who showed up as king of swords binding energies two of cups the sun that's beautiful so you guys are soulmates from many other lifetimes so this actually this actually will bring some healing to the both of you even though after all is said and done you'll be able to go separate ways uh this will bring a lot of healing uh, this is very good you won't be uh feeling as resentful and they won't be feeling as resentful mm -hmm. yeah healing healing coming to the both of you so that's beautiful the moon card showed up for the second time. So communication will be present be between the both of you. Face-to-face -face communication, which will be good and helpful. I like it. Let's see. Advice for you. Universe, please step in. Show advice for the sign of cancer for October advice for the sign of cancer for october two of pentacles justice okay so a lot of you are involved in court dealings with this individual again some of you were married to this person some of you are still married to this person uh, some of you are divorcing this person some of you Others, others um, of you have uh, divorced this person, but you are involved in some other case that has to do with cords because of them. Could be anything, child support, alimony, anything. Uh, Knight of Wands, the moon card again for the third time. Let's clarify the moon card. Nine of Cups, beautiful wish fulfillment with uh, t um, Empress very good so victory for you there's gonna be a battle you're gonna have to battle it out but whenever courts are involved battle is involved as well I want to see this justice card energy over here clarification for this energy universe please clarify this justice card for cancerians you you worrying excessively you worrying too much unnecessarily the universe wants you to know that whatever is meant to happen will happen uh for your soul's higher learning 
So remember, you are balancing a lot of karmic debts with this individual from other lifetimes. you learning from each other. Again, um, Gemini energy. So a lot of you are, in fact, dealing with the Gemini. Or obviously, uh, uh, the rest of you are dealing with other signs. But again, shown um, the lover's card. I don't know, was it like three times already? Gemini energy is very significant here. Yeah. So I feel Gemini energy and Libra energy a lot because of King of Swords, but also King of Swords represents the other two air signs which is uh, Gemini and Aquarius. But you're worrying too much. Um, don't overstress. Don't overanalyze because whatever is meant to happen will happen. Yeah, look at this. You, you really were uh, done wrong by this individual. Three of Swords again. You were deeply hurt. Uh, by this person but the universe is reminding you you have a soul contract with this individual that you signed before you incarnated into this lifetime so you were supposed to meet them you were supposed to go through challenges with them to learn lessons from each other but you will heal so here it is, after Three of Swords, Four of Swords, you will heal and you will love again. So this is beautiful energy. Emperor and Empress. I want to take another deck and see what's that about. That's beautiful. Emperor and Empress. Let's see the energy between the Emperor and Empress. Strength card. Look at this. King of Swords again. So some of you will be meeting somebody that's significant. It's going to be significant, significant in your life. Uh, Leo sign showing up here. Wow. It's like unexpected meeting. But the king of swords showed up again i want to clarify why this king of swords showed up let me see so the person you're thinking of showed up again as king of swords i want to see this also could mean a judge and a lawyer the king of swords and this is the justice card so i want to see which one it is is it somebody from the legal system or the person you're thinking of Ah, so it is a person that you were with. So they were, they were either married to you or lived with you at some point. Again, Gemini energy. I don't know how many times this has shown up with the lover's card. So a lot of you are in fact dealing with a Gemini and you will heal from this drama and everything will turn out the way it's supposed to turn out for your soul's higher learning. Yeah, your heart is closed off. Well, it's, it's good to... Yeah, look at this. Seven of Swords. So they're very sneaky towards you. So you're going to have to be very careful. But they won't be able to get away with much justice card i mean judgment card let me clarify the judgment card universe please clarify the judgment card <laughs> um tower again so something shocking well the judgment will be good in your favor judgment judgment literally judgment card and judgment will be in your favor you showed up here as the queen of pentacles so you will be victorious in this. Even if you're not going to get as much as you hoped for, 
you will be victorious in many ways depending how you look at it uh, you learning uh, spiritually you learning about yourself and your connections with other people yeah so it's a disagreement battle between you and this person but again um, with the wheel of fortune and justice here you balancing a lot of karmic debts with this individual so um, try not to resent them too much try not to hate them too much because that would just be negative for you yeah just understand that they develop in different ways than you do and you do have lessons to learn from each other mm -hmm. all in all this is very good let's see more more messages universe how about advice advice for cancerians more advice for cancerians universe please show more advice for cancerians eight of cups yeah they the universe your guides are asking you to release toxic negative emotions resentment uh anger that you feel towards this person release it let it go because it's toxic you're gonna be good you're gonna be fine again you showed up as queen of pentacles so that's if if that has to do with the court system that means you're gonna do just fine and look they showed up next to you again as the king of swords let me see what shows up after king of swords they are looking right at you here yeah so a lot of you were married to this person a lot of you are still married to this person a lot of you were living with this person under the same roof Mm -hmm. let me clarify this king of swords energy again because this person is looking right at you so you on their mind a lot universe please clarify this king of swords energy towards cancerians so they want to speak to you truthfully yeah money again showed up family money so this a lot of you will have to have this individual in your life because of kids there is this means there's kids involved for a lot of you star card but it's gonna be good because you're gonna learn yeah so they have a lot of regrets they have a lot of regrets they learning they learning Mm-hmm. This is good. So this is going to bring a lot of healing for the both of you. Uh, release this, this energy. The universe is asking you to, for you to release this toxic energy you feel of anger, resentment. If sometimes you catch yourself feeling it, re release it. Mm-hmm. You're going to be fine financially. You're going to be fine after this is all said and done i feel a little more information they need to show for you cancerians universe please show more information for the sign of cancer for october 10 of oh 10 of one showed up reversed so 10 of ones right side up means you you have too many burdens you're carrying working too much worrying too much but reversed is actually a good message that means you'll be able to release a lot of that a lot of those burdens you're feeling a lot of that heavy weight you've had on your shoulders two of wands three of swords again yeah that's good that's good three of swords is never good but with the six of swords after that means after all is said and done you'll be able to heal from this heartache that sustain that you sustained very deep emotional wounds and you're gonna heal from it so you've been through a lot of drama with this individual over the years a lot of drama yeah and you will be compensated accordingly mm-hmm 
Gemini again showed up. So a lot of you are dealing, you showed up as a queen of swords, very discerning, very analytical, thinking objectively like a judge, and you're going to be happy with the outcome because this is wish fulfillment, nine of cups. So you're going to be happy. Yeah, high priestess. So the moon card. So a lot of the moon card with the high priestess a lot of secrets so this person holds a lot of withholds a lot of secrets from you but it won't matter yeah don't fight with that person when you see arguments coming up just try to steer away from it yeah this person can be vicious with words but this is beautiful judgment card with the three of pentacles seven of cups so this person can be very stubborn and rigid but you're going to be okay the sun card the best card in the entire deck you're going to be okay more than okay so cancerians uh you have a lot of drama going on at home wow difficult difficult situations uh so cancerians i want to thank you for watching and if you have a personal reading that you need you can email me otherwise i will talk to you soon thank you so much for watching